Hey guys, so um, I will be jailbreaking my iPod Touch 3rd generation, which is on firmware 4.3.1 right now. Um, Red Snow has just released um, a new, uh, well the iPhone dev team I guess, I'm not sure who, but anyways, a new Red Snow was released. Um, it is 0 0.9.6 release candidate 9. And um, what this does is it works on all iPhones, all iPods, the iPad 1, and I don't think it works on the iPad 2. But this is an untethered jailbreak for 4.3.1. So yeah. Anyways, let's start off here. Uh, you're going to have to download the firmware corresponding to your, um, what is it? Yeah, to your uh, device. I have an iPod Touch, third generation, so that's what I downloaded. I'll leave the link for uh, the firmware downloads uh, on the video. Is you going to go to Browse and find where you put it. Now select it, and it's going to process the firmware. This might take about a minute or two. Um, hopefully mine should be fast, just because I was loading it before. But anyways, we'll just let it process. Anyways, now um, our IPSW has successfully been identified, which is just the firmware. So yeah, anyways, we can hit next, and it is going to prepare the data for us. And this shouldn't take too long. Anyways, now uh, we need to set our options. I will be installing Cydia and enabling my battery percentage. I'll just be doing those two. Now click next. It's going to tell you to throw your device into DFU mode. Now mine is already in DFU mode. It looks like it's off, but as you can see, it's in DFU. Uh, it's connected and everything. I will post a link up uh, to someone else who knows how to put in DFU mode. I know how to thing is I don't want to make a video just because it's really annoying and I hate putting it in DFU mode. So yeah. Anyways, once it's in there, go ahead hit next. And mine automatically goes on. Now we're going to have a side-by-side -side comparison of what's going on. It says uploading the RAM disk. And generally, um... If you get to that stage, oh, it starts going crazy right there. If uh, it says uploading RAM disk and your uh, red snow crashes on you, I will have another video. Please watch that because that might fix that up. Uh, you have not done anything wrong. Just uh, check out that video. Anyways, let's let this stay here so we can see what's going on. As you can see, check this out. Slides on lock. Come on. Go over here, and we should have Cydia. So, yeah, anyways, if you have Cydia, that means you are good to go. Now, I'm just going to enter my Wi Fi password and open up Cydia. 
So the first time you run Cydia, it's going to just load for about a minute or two saying it will um, rearrange the file system and all that. But um, after it quits out, you should just boot it up. And um, when you first open up, this is my second time opening it up after that, but the first time you can choose if you're a hacker, developer, or a user. Uh, I just always select user. But anyways, here we are in Cydia. And you can start messing around on here and everything. So yeah. Anyways, I will show you guys the firmware version again. I am on 4.31. Well, 4.3.1, my bad. And we have successfully been able to jailbreak this untethered. So yeah. Anyways, that's it. If you have any questions, just leave a comment or anything. And yeah, that should be it. Anyways, thanks for watching.